Hi guys, what's up and welcome back to our channel. For today's video, we are doing Trenton's five month update. I cannot believe this baby is five months old already and he's doing so many new things. It's absolutely crazy all the stuff that he's done. Um, but we are going to go ahead and jump into the video. transported to a different hospital because our hospital doesn't really have um, nurses that deal with little babies like they have an ER but they don't really keep them overnight because they're not used to babies so we had to be transported about um, 45 minutes to an hour away and stay overnight and just um, have them monitor and watch him um, but he's doing okay now um, it was just really rough on him and uh, it's really scary to see your baby sick for the first time uh, especially what we went through and how bad RSB can be how bad it is um, I know a lot of people deal with it worse than we did but um, yeah it's just scary having your baby sick but that's why our video is up late um, he's finally feeling back to his normal self and he's super happy and um, he's just a good baby, like even with RSB he was still smiling even though he was not feeling the best and he's just a really good kid. <clears throat> but anyway, I don't have anything written out. I've been terrible at writing things down this month so I might leave a whole lot out and I might repeat some of the stuff that I did in the previous video but um, I'll try my best to just get through everything and yeah, so here we go. First off, little booger man. Last time we weighed him, it's been uh, probably close to like five, six days, close to a week since we weighed him. But last time we weighed him, he weighed 18 pounds and 3.5 ounces. <laughs> He's big. He's a big little boy. Um, and last time we measured, he was over 27 inches long. I don't remember the exact measurement. Um, he is just growing so fast. He's chunking up a lot. It seems like he just eats all the time. Um, he's eating baby food now. His favorite baby food is butternut squash and sweet potatoes. <laughs> he loves those. He's not really about the fruits. He loves vegetables. I don't know if it's because... He's not used to eating baby food and it's like just too sweet right off the bat or what, but right now he doesn't like any of the fruits, I mean including bananas. He just doesn't like them. He likes veggies, which is good. I mean, I guess he might like veggies more than sweets. I don't know, <laughs> but he, <clears throat> he loves his veggies. Um, also, if I'm like hacking a little bit, I also caught the cold when he had RSV me and Matt had the cold too and uh so I'm still like <clears throat> like I'm not sick but it's still I don't know iffy in my throat um we're doing we're all doing much better now thank goodness uh it was rough on us adults so I don't know how babies have it but anyway I got sidetracked um he is rolling over everywhere like all the time if you put him in the floor boom he rolled over and he's trying to get a toy um he it's not full on scooting yet but he does it quite a bit um i don't know if he's aware that he's doing it but he is he'll scoot towards a toy or whatever but he's not consistently doing it yet 
But um, yeah, he loves to roll over. Um, he's scooting more. What else are you doing, little mister? So I laugh all the time. I giggle. I try to talk back. He said his first word. Um, can you guess what it was? It was Dada. Like, okay, it's fine. I just let you bite off my boob all the time. Yeah, you can go ahead and say Dada first. No. Uh, <laughs> I'm glad he said that at first. It made Matt's head swell, but, you know, whatever. He's a good daddy, so I guess I'll be nice and let him live his best life with the word dada. But, um, no, he hasn't said mama yet or anything else, but he has said dada. He loves his dada. He's got a really good daddy. Um, our daddy is involved in our life a ton like I love my husband to death like he really helps me a lot I know a lot of men like don't really help their wives or try to help their wives but um my husband's a real one like he'll drop everything he's doing for this little boy like he he's amazing he really it not that most dads don't love their babies they just don't they just don't help as much, I feel like. Um, <clears throat> he is obsessed with Trenton. Like, he will do anything for him. If I need him to do anything with Trenton, he doesn't complain about it. He just does it. Um, he doesn't love changing the poopy diapers, but what dad does, <laughs> you know? Like, he just, he just doesn't like that part of it. But he will if he has to. He loves this little boy, and we're so thankful for him. Um, but yeah, let's see. What else are you doing? What else are you doing? He just does all kinds of stuff, and I don't write it, I didn't write it down this month, so I'm like trying to remember all the stuff that he's done, because like, he'll do one thing, and then he'll do like four new things, and I'm like, what are you doing? Like, you cannot grow up this fast. <laughs> it's so sad. Um... He loves his jumperoo, like that is his absolute favorite toy. We will get up in the morning and we'll sit down in the recliner to feed and he'll see his jumperoo when he gets done and he'll just sit and jump on my lap and stare at that thing until I put him in it. He loves it. He'll jump in it and he'll watch um, <laughs> Boss Baby and he just loves it. Boss Baby is his favorite and Mickey Mouse, like he is obsessed with Mickey Mouse, like he can hear Mickey Mouse and he's just like where is it at like I want to watch it um but we got him an iPad I don't remember if I mentioned this in the last video if I had it yet or not but um he doesn't like his car seat very much at night and so I thought about it and I got an iPad and I downloaded like um what is it called Disney Plus on his iPad and just like attached it to the back of the seat and well, okay <laughs> attached it to the back of the seat and let him watch it when we're traveling and he loves it it's made a world of difference um with him in his car seat he's always been good in the car seat but he gets bored really easy and he'll just kind of whine um and he'll cry at night like he does not like it at night and i'll turn the lights on when i'm traveling and everything and he just does not like it at night and that gives him something to look at and something to do and he loves it like i don't have an ounce of trouble on road trips anymore with him so i highly recommend getting um an amazon tablet for them to watch even when they're this young i know like a lot of people are against it or whatever but if it keeps them busy and not crying um, when we're on road trips, then that's what I'm going to do because I don't let him cry in the car seat. Um, if he starts crying in the car seat, I'll pull over and get him out. I just don't like him being back there crying and screaming and stuff. I just, I can't do it. <laughs> I might change my mind later on when I've been a mom longer. Um, but... Mm. At the moment, I just, I don't like that, so <laughs> it really helps having that thing. But, um, I have a little box below in the description, and it'll have, um, my Amazon products that I recommend, and I'll link the setup below, um, in that. 
What are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> okay, you want your passy instead of my finger? How about that? How about that? Say hi to the camera. Say hi to the camera. Say hello, hello. I'm changing, I'm changing. <laughs> but yeah, um, <clears throat> I love that thing and we use it all the time. Oh, are you excited? Are you so excited? Say, I want that camera, Mama. <laughs> he is so sweet. Um, what else? Oh, we still haven't got the teeth, the, the tooth that we were saying was coming in in the last video. You could just barely see it sticking out. We still haven't got it, but we are still teething, and we're getting another tooth beside it. I don't know when they'll actually come through. Um, my nephew is seven months old now, and he's got, like, a ton of teeth. He's got, like, well, he just cut six at once, and I don't know the exact amount of teeth that he has, but I know recently he cut six teeth at once. And so he cuts them like super fast and Trenton, um, he's getting them, but he just doesn't like get them in like my nephew does. So I don't know when they'll actually come in, but you can see them for sure. Um, he, I guess he's just a slow teether. I don't know. But yeah, he's been chewing on everything and you can tell that he's super uncomfortable with his teeth. So I hope they come through here pretty soon so he's not hurting with his teeth. He's always got his hands in his mouth and you can just tell they don't feel good at all. Like right now he's munching on his shirt. Do you want this? You want this? Get this thing. Here, get this thing. Oh, you're making your shirt all wet. It's okay. It's okay. But yeah, we're getting two teeth and what else are we doing, Trenton? Mommy can't remember all your stuff because you do so much. Mm. He is getting so big though. And <clears throat> it's just crazy how fast he's growing. Like, especially at this point now. Like, I just can't believe he's already to the point where he's, like, trying to scoot around and stuff. I'm about to have to baby proof my whole house because I know it's coming soon. Like, I don't want it to. I'm in denial. I don't want him to crawl. I don't want him to walk. I just want him to stay little forever. But I know that that's not going to happen and he's got to grow up. It's fun watching him grow, but it's like really sad at the same time because he's my little baby. But I'm super proud of him. Um, as far as sleeping goes, um, it's kind of here and there about napping during the day. Um, he was doing really good, like taking two hour naps every time he napped in the day, but now it's real iffy. Um, he might do 30 minute naps during the day, or he might do like one 30 minute and then like one two hour nap or an hour nap. He just kind of goes back and forth and it's not real regular. Um, if we're in the car, he'll nap, you know, to wherever we're going. He's really good about napping in the car, but as far as being home, um, he naps anywhere from 30 minutes to two hours. Most days it's 30 minutes and then sometimes if he's real tired at the end of the day it'll be an hour nap. He doesn't really nap for two hours often unless he's laying beside me and I'm in bed with him. <laughs> so yeah that's here and there. As far as sleeping at night he's a really good sleeper I feel like. Um, he usually wakes up once or twice a night. Um, so he really doesn't do bad. He goes to bed at 8 every single night. Um, he usually goes right down. I nurse him to sleep every time. Um, but yeah, he usually does pretty good. He usually goes to bed at 8 and he wakes up once or twice during the night. Um, I feel like he's a pretty good sleeper. I feel like he's been a good sleeper since I brought him home from the hospital, really. Um, I don't really feel like I'm super sleep deprived like I originally thought I would be 
with how everyone talks about how you don't sleep with newborns, I thought it was going to be, I guess I expected the worst, <laughs> we'll just say, and um, he ended up being a really good baby and a really good sleeper, and I still feel like he's sleeping really good, um, yeah, his sleep is, I'm happy with his sleep, um, we co-sleep with him, he sleeps in his dog tot <clears throat> no trouble there, he loves his dog tot and then during the day, he naps in his crib, and he's just kind of iffy on the during the day naps, which is fine with me. Like, it's hard to get things done, but I usually set him in his bouncer and his walker, and he is pretty occupied there. Sometimes I turn Boss Baby on and let him watch that while he's in his walker playing in the floor or you know whatever he's doing it kind of distracts him a little more while I get dishes done or laundry done but yeah um he does pretty good he's real good with traveling um man he's just doing so much I can't even I feel like I'm forgetting like a ton of stuff but um yeah he's he's a really good baby he's happy all the time yeah it's my all the time yeah <laughs> Yeah, yeah, giggle box. I'm a giggle box. Giggle, 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 giggle. <laughs> At the moment, I can't think of anything else. Um, I know I'm forgetting a bunch of stuff, but I just kind of sat down in the middle of the day. Like, I wasn't expecting to sit down, but I had makeup on today, so I was like, okay, today's as good as any to do this because I don't wear makeup hardly. I usually just go without makeup and live my best life so I thought it would be a good day to record since I was wearing makeup and look like a human I mean I still got my t-shirt and shorts on but hey at least I did something to my face um but yeah sorry the five month update was late it was due to him being sick um I think that's going to be all for this video. If you guys like this video, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe. Um, hit the bell notification if you want to get notified every time we post a new video. Thank you guys for all the likes and the comments and following me on Instagram, messaging me. Um, I love getting to know my followers and like where you guys are from. Super awesome and we are so thankful for all of you that watch our channel. Um, but yeah, I think we are going to end the video here. Um, hope you guys are having a great day and we will see you guys in our next video. Bye.